Hey YouTube, it's Mr. Lubufu here with another pair of going to be M13 sealed simulators. Unfortunately, I lost another series that, or another pair of videos that I had filmed, which is rather unfortunate. Uh, we're not going to go over this one because it has the best blue mythic in the set. So, it actually has four mythics and two rares, which is kind of silly. So let's go ahead and open some up. Ah, excellent. A bad mythic rare. Now let's take a look at our, our normal rares. Plinder Cleansing is not bad. Uh, a Wrath Effect is typically pretty powerful. A uh, Reverberate's not that good. Arc Druid is alright. Gilded Lotus is quite good if you want to play like Plinder, Plinder Cleansing. Not so much World Fire, but I mean, if you're very greedy, you could get it to work, but then, you know, you really wouldn't do much. But let's see. Uh, we have Trading Post, which is, I think, you know, n on the worse side, I don't, I, I, I think it's like average. When it comes to cards, may, I, I have no idea where to rank it. So let's take a look at our uncommons. If we want to play this Planner Cleanse, we want to have enough white to back it up. And I mean, Angelic Benediction is fine. Two of them, you know, they, they only get better as they as you have more of them, I think. But it's not, you know, insane. Sarah Angel is quite good, just because 4-4 four, four Flying Vigilance is for 5 are not bad. War Priest is nothing extraordinary. We have a Johnny Sunstriker, which is fine. Avon Squire is fine. Double Divine Verdict is okay. Uh, Griffin Protector is quite good. And a couple of twos. So it looks like we have a decent amount of white. Let's see if we have anything else to back it up. Well, Ring of Thun is a good way to start. Randomly giving a key creature vigilance and making it bigger each turn seems pretty good. Primal Clay is okay, and Elixir of Immortality would also be cards worth playing. But the thing is, right, if we look at these uncommons, right, we have Sleep and Arctic Aven um, in blue, which kind of makes me want to go blue white. We have Rise from the Grave, Harbor Bandit, uh, basically go black blue, Double Crimson Mud Waiter, which I call Mud Whacker always, which makes me want to go red black, and Garrick's Pack Leader, which is good in green. So let's look for what can give us the best support. Even though Planar Cleansing is quite powerful, um, let's take a look at our other comments. Ultimately, what makes a good seal deck is not just being able to play your your most powerful cards, but also having the support to back it up. So for example, Blue may have Arctic Aven and Sleep, but if you see Triple Kraken Hatchling, like you really don't have too much to take advantage of the Sleep. Maybe Fairy Invaders, but there's not many big flyers anyway. Whereas here, if you look at the uh, black, you got Zombie Glass, Goliath, Walking Corpse. Sure, Servant's okay. Actually no, Servant's better than okay, it's above average. A ravenous Rats is okay, Murder's good, Essence Strain. So it looks like our black is powerful. So I'm considering doing that. Let's look at our other stuff. Uh, triple Create. Is that Quad? That's Quad Crater Eyes. That's not good. Fire Elemental's okay. Kindled Fury is among the better removal spells, but there's not really much else to back it up. So I probably won't play red. Now let's see what we have for green. Um, we have an Elvish Arc Druid which is a good start considering we have double arbor elf so we have some decent amount of ramp but really nothing to abuse it so i mean a sentinel spider is quite powerful and deadly recluse is fine but rather than that triple ranger's path is pretty bad so it looks like all in, uh, overall our colors are not you know insane white actually is among the better ones now it's just a matter of what we want to pair with it uh, i think I think black is actually, no, black is stronger than white, what am I talking about? Uh, black is our strongest color, now it's just what we want to back it up with. Now, black, blue would make Harbor Bandit quite good, um, and we'd have some defensive guys and some flyers. Rise from the Grave is quite good too. I don't know, I think black, blue might be the way to go with this. It's kind of difficult. Ring, ring and planar cleansing makes me want to go into white, but I don't think white has nearly enough cards to, to support it. So I think blue black would be the right approach. Maybe splash for something, but I don't really see what you could splash for. Probably not much. Maybe a white source for Arctic Haven, but that seems very very greedy. Okay, so that's this first seal pool. Let's do one more um, before we continue on with the night. Boom. Okay, well, we opened 
two bomb artifacts and a chromos memorial and staff and staff and is less bomby but just very very powerful and then we have we actually have choices now we've got among the better white rares uh, a pretty powerful blue rare a powerful black rare and a powerful green rare so we've got all sorts of shenanigans so let's take a look at what can support these best so for white we have angelic benediction again not insane Elephant's only really good if you have a forest. And Reign of Blades is nothing extraordinary. If we're blue, Double Arctic Haven's very, very good. Uh, if you're white, to go with it. Now, black has has me pulled because of Double Vampire Nighthawk Rise, Rise from the Grave. Like, right, that right there means I'm playing black. I don't care what, what else I see. Black's one of our colors. It doesn't matter what color we want to match it with. Uh, green does have double dusk tail worm. The question is, how heavy is our curve to make the dusk tail worm good? We do have a ring of uh, colonia, so green does have that extra thing. Gem of becoming is also fine. Actually, not really. Gem of becoming's ideal in a blue, black, or red base. Like you have two of those colors, and you're splashing for the third. Here, it kind of looks like we're heading to black green. Speaking of black green, let's look at our green commons. Double Timberback Wolf is fine. Um, Spike Bailoff is not that good, so having three of them is not, not a good card. And really nothing else, so our green commons aren't very strong. Let's look at what black cards, because we're definitely playing black. Double Servant of Nephrox, is that triple? Triple Servant of Nephrox, Double Ravenous Wrath, Murder, Mind Rot, Shade, Scorpion, and uh, Blood Hunter Bat. Yeah. Black, our black is very powerful, so it's just what we want to mesh with it. Um, green does have Thrag Tusk, but I don't think that that's good enough. kind of want to look at our blue, because blue blue gives us triple divination, double archaeomancer, and a windrake. Hmm, not that good. So this is one of the cases where you have one color set, and the other one's not so much. So islands and mountains. If it was islands and plains would be better, but I can see why they did that. Um, red gives us rummaging goblin, goblin, a lot of goblin arsonists. Yeah, not our red is nowhere near good enough, and our white has the best removal spell or the best combat trick. And I think, I think despite the fact that white black is typically color intensive again this one as well is a lot is a little pretty heavy on the black with murder shade um, and double nighthawk but I think black white is the build you want to go here because anything that goes well with nighthawks are exalted but that's in white um, or in black sorry attendant knights good captain's calls fine uh, divine verdict and pacifism are good things to go in a show of valor is just really powerful and Captain of Watch is just another another bomby creature to to deal with. So yeah, this 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 pool was pretty good. Not the nuttiest one I've opened where I opened double Jace, double Chandra, triple Mind Sculpt. Yeah, that was that was a good that was a good pool to open. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Rate, comp, subscribe. Let me know if you guys want to see more of this. It seems like the first one went over pretty well, so hopefully I can help you guys uh, walk through a little bit more, so you guys can do well at your uh, sealed events. Thank you guys for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe.